Hey guys, so if you want to like, comment, subscribe, and don't forget to click the notification bell be, to be notified every time I post a new video. If you want to follow me on Instagram, check out my Amazon storefront and follow my podcast called I Talk A Lot and Read It 5 Stars, even though I have not posted an episode in a really freaking long time. So, I'm going to be obviously showing you guys some gift ideas. These are pretty high on the list, so that's why I decided to just like separate my gift ideas from like cheaper and compared to like the really expensive gift. I was gonna do it like all combined, but that would just be like a super long video. And you know me, I tend to talk and ramble a lot. So I decided that would probably be the worst. That would, yeah, that would be probably the worst idea and save you guys a lot more time. So I'm just gonna get right into it. Number one, uh, I am also reading off a list so that's why i will be looking down number one is this product called art picks 3d crystal like laser photo thing um the reason why i don't have it here is because one i gave it as a gift and i don't know if said person threw that out i'm assuming they did no no uh, not offended. I completely understand why, but I really liked it because it was such a good gift idea. It's such like a personalized gift. You can do like a photo for your like family members or your partner or your friends. And it's like, you can literally do one of your favorite photo memories. And they obviously have like, there's a bunch of them on Amazon, but this one I specifically chose just because it's a good price range. It's a little expensive, but it's not like super cheap. And it's not like $300, $200. Cause I think there was like one that was like 100 something dollars. It did not get a lot of reviews and it's like, did not seem like very good and a reputable, good from a reputable, reputable seller or brand itself. So I really like it. It was like so cute. It it took a while to make. I think I did order this like immediately the day of Christmas when I bought this uh, thing. And I think it took maybe like a week and a half, two weeks. I will say it was because it was Christmas time. So I don't know compared to like when you normally buy it. Typically it might take a week and a half two weeks or it may just come like really quickly for you next one i have this it's a t3 curl and iron iron i cannot say that word correctly this i believe is a yeah one fourth inch i believe it is kind of forgot but i will show it to you guys the picture obviously but I really like this because it's so cute. I love the color. Preferably, I wish this part was gold and not rose gold, but that's fine. I like this. Um, there is one where you have like um, an unchangeable head or you can just simply just buy what head you really like and you don't even have to buy the extras, which I prefer that way because I won't like need a smaller one or like a super big one, you know. I just know my size that I like. So I've used this before. I really like it. It heats up really fast. I think I will say for my hair to curl, I do have to have this on like the highest setting ever because like it's just so my hair's so sick and it just never curls correctly. Next one is a skincare raw and train and wrong one that I got. This is the Dermalogical Smart Response Serum. I've used this for quite a long time for quite some months. I really, really like it. It's nice. Um doesn't have like a smell. It is very expensive. What is me tell you? I do not use a very much of this. I try to use like a really tiny amount, but not too tiny where you don't get any product on your head face and you just can only do one area. So I try to use this sparingly. Next product is the Skin Medica Retinol Complex. 
this is pretty expensive this is pretty dang high next product is a lower dosage which honestly i really like is the dermatological retinol um i like it. it comes in a cute little bottle um one thing i do not like about those products is i can never see how much i have left which is one thing i never really like I prefer like the um, ordinary, sorry, my brain's like blinking. I know like this is an expensive gift list, but off topic, the ordinary is like a super cheap product. Like it's kind of, it can be six, seven dollars or up to like 20 bucks at the highest, I believe. But it's really good because it comes in glass bottles and you are able to see like how much left you have, which I prefer, but yeah. That slipped out of my hand, sorry. Next gift is this Crepe Erase um, Cream for your neck. Um, I can kind of see how much I have left, but not really. Um, so I like this, it literally looks like this, and you just like pump, like you don't need a ton. And you, what you do is just rub it in and rub it like upwards instead of downwards. I don't know why, I just do that. Next gift I have is my AirPods. Anything from Apple is going to be very expensive. I will just tell you that. I have the Apple AirPods. I think it was like the third generation. Um, it literally looks like this. So I prefer the flat heads because the other kinds just don't fit in my ears because my ears are like super, super, super tiny. So if you so if you have like really tiny ears i recommend this like any airpods or like normal um headphones with like flat heads those will work best for your ears next product is the ember mug i do not have this i want to get it so freaking bad um i love coffee or tea or whatever you drink um and the coolest thing is there's an app on your phone and you can control how much like temperature you want it and i watched someone named rachel like rach loves i freaking love her so much and she tested this i believe like last year or the year before that and ever since then i've been dying to get this mug just because instead of using a um mug warmer which is like fine but you if you want to control how hot things are that is the way to go but i will say it's very expensive for just one so i don't know if you are willing to take that risk i will for sure next gift i have right here it's kind of heavy is the oxo brand so i have the eight piece set um currently um what i'm showing you guys i put the like um 10 piece set but i don't have the 10 piece set i have the eight set i also did get the um last year the also 20 piece set and that is like really freaking expensive but for me i prefer that so much better just because one it's a safe not safer it's an easier way for you to store your food it's expensive but that way you don't have to like push down on the ledge or have to make sure you know is it closed all the way you just like click a button and there we go it's like sealed i love that i've not used it but i cannot wait to use that when i move out next product is this i have this also it's the marco almond 14 piece gold knife set my hair is blocking it sorry so this is what it looks like and what it comes with is this sorry so it comes with a chef knife slicing knife same toko knife and some word that i not, do not know how to say a uh, serrated utility knife a utility knife a paring knife an all-purpose shears um, and six steak knives, which I love gold. You do not have to get this color, but I prefer gold and I am a gold fanatic. So preferably I wanted my stuff to be in gold. So yes, I got it. 
Next product is a Craig. Now, I have one right now over here. I'm just too lazy to move the camera and show you or pick it up because it's plugged in. But I freaking love Craig's. Craig's are the best. I don't have any espresso. I wanted to try one, but then I realized I don't think I would like any espresso just because it's more expensive and honestly, I find that kind of pointless. Like, I like my Keurig better than an espresso, but then again, I'm not very much a coffee lover, coffee enthusiast. I drink it for the taste. The next product is another set of guys, different brand, but I wanted to get those because they also have more um, steak knives. Um, so I decided why not? I'm planning on getting that. I don't have it, but I want to get it. Next. One is is Apple Air Tags. Um, so I don't have Apple Air Tags, but I will say people seem to really love them. If you put one in your purse, your backpack, or like you know your wallet or something, that seems to be very good. Personally, I'm not a fan of it. I find that to be slightly terrifying. So yeah, I don't know why I said. Um, this wasn't the last product, but this, that was the last product, and I hope you guys like this video. Bye, guys!